everybody. Welcome to Pearl's Progress. I'm Chris Pervos, and today I have Ludovic, who's from Disneyland Paris. And today is his very last day in Disneyland Paris. He's going home today. We're very sad. But we're going to make a video, and I'm going to show you five foods that you can only get in Disneyland that you cannot get in Disneyland Paris. And we're going to have Ludovic chase them and see what he thinks. Yes. And I'm going to sprinkle in some rides that he can go on that don't have a Disneyland Paris as well. So let's do this, guys. Woo-woo! All right, so the very first thing that we're gonna get to eat is here at the Jolly Holiday Bakery Cafe. Uh, Ludovic cannot believe that they don't have this in Disneyland Paris because it's it seems like it should be from, it's from Paris, basically. Yes. Patisserie. Uh, yeah, patisserie. Patisserie. Yeah, pastry. So we're gonna show you this and they don't have it and he's jealous. He's jealous. <laughs> Let's walk right in here to the Jolly Holiday. Get it. So how did you end up with the canoes without me? I am so I am so angry at you right now. We were walking by and there was like nobody there. I'm like, hey, let's do the canoes. He's like, should we wait? I'm like, nah, nah, this will be fine. You can ride it again later. <laughs> <laughs> Ludovic, let's do it again. We'll be the only people in the history of Disney to do canoes two times in one day. Other than the cast members. If right. All right, so here I'm gonna order two things. Really, one's a safe, but they have a special here for Halloween. So show that. Can we get the raspberry? And then the mummy. Which one do you like better? Mummy. Are you serious? How are you? I'm doing so good. I'm just, so this is my friend Ludovic. He's a oh. Disneyland Paris cast member. Oh, I, wait, did you guys do the... Yes. I saw and that. He's freaking, freaking out because he eat the raspberry. They don't have that in France. Oh, and he's like, it's so good. It's so good. Mummy's better. Mommy. Is it really? I take mummy. Okay. So it one is, mommy, one it raspberry. is delicious. I, I love the mummy. Share. Yeah, let's share. Let's yeah. see. All right, so these pastries, they don't have these pastries in Disneyland Paris, which is kind of weird because that's where they like macaroons, they like, type things really from like France. They don't have them, so we're gonna have Ludovic try it and see what he thinks. So big. Yeah. I think you're the happiest to eat of these. <laughs> I do like sugar. This is only during Halloween time. Now, the cast member said that this one's better. It's a cookies and cream variation. That's really hard for me to believe because this is my fav one of my very favorites. So which one do you want to go with first? I trust the cast member's review. Oh, it's cast member's review? Okay, so we'll do this. All right. All right, let me do this. Don't, Cameron and Greg's all worried that he's not gonna get some. Don't worry, don't worry. <laughs> Good. That might be better. That's so, that's so good. Oh, let's go in for that one. They don't have these in Disneyland Paris. You cannot get them there, which is very odd. It's fresh. It's, oh uh, yeah. My roommate loves that. This better. I love that so I much. I prefer this one. No. <laughs> I prefer this one. Don't tell me my preference. Don't tell me what. <laughs> you're wrong. <laughs> it's so good. I forgot. I haven't had it in a while. So, it's amazing. So if you're coming from Design Paris, check this out. You have to get this. This is oh, this is limited. This is very limited. What's it called in French? When it's um, raspberry, it's a fraisier. Fraisier? Fraisier. Frisier. It's very popular in France, but not in Disneyland Paris. Wait, is it raspberry frizzing or is the macaroon frizzing? No macaroon, it's only uh, like a pie. It's a little, it's a little pie. pie. Okay, frizzy. Okay, you but can't, it's, you don't get any more. It's a good, no, but it's a good mix. No. It's a good mix. You don't get any more. It's, it's a good mix. Just take the whole thing, put that in here. Just do it, the big one. That's a lot. <laughs> you can do it. Can't, I can't do all of it. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. But I love cookies and cream, and I know that this, that's what this one is. Yes. You can do stretch. it. <laughs> you can do it. I can't do it. You can do it. You can do it. Oh my god. Yes! <laughs> no. Oh. Is, that, is that how you eat it in Paris? No, no. <laughs> Alright. Can you taste it? Mm. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's coming out of this mouth. <laughs> 
Look away. If you have, if you have a, if you have a, a delicate sensibility, look away. What do you think? It's delicious. Well, give us a review. You're not saying anything. What are you doing? You always tell I me. I love right? it. <laughs> I love it. Now this one. It's so delicious. I just ate some more of it. Now I have to see if Cameron gets reaction. I really do love the cookies and cream one. Yeah. The, the special holiday one. It's delicious. But I really love this one too. So, and I am not a sweet person at all. So this is like way well, too much sugar. Sweet. For He's me. a sweet person, but he doesn't like sweet. No, things. I'm kind of salty. All right. See <laughs> what you got. Mmm. I still love this one better. Do you? Me too. It's so good. It's the tart. I it is. The tart. That's what I like too. And I why we're tart. filming this, I look over and Ludovic's already going for it. <laughs> it's that little bit of tart in there. It's just so good. I just love it so much. It's so good too, this one. It's good. You like that one too? Yeah. I don't know why this one probably is the no bad. It's it's amazing. It's so, so good. It will be, it will be a very success. In this big, big, yeah. big success? I think, yeah. Yes. So we are, we've done the we've done the number five thing, That's right. but before we can do that, we have to take Ludovic because he wants to do Alice in Wonderland because they don't have Alice in Wonderland in Disneyland Paris either. The other thing that uh, Ludovic mentioned, he noticed the portion sizes in America are much larger. Uh, in in France, he says that you you only eat what's brought to you. You don't leave things in your plate. Uh, and that's just not something in their culture. So they get smaller portions so they can finish the plate and clean the plate. And he's like, you guys got so much food. And I'm like, yeah, it's just America. It's how we do it. So let's go do Alice in Wonderland. Now in Disneyland Paris, they do have they have Alice in Wonderland, but it's like it's like a it's a hedge maze, and this is a, they don't have like an attraction. So Ludovic really wanted to try this. So let's do this, then we'll continue on the food. So we're gonna go through here. This is a Ludovic have a chance experience Alice in Wonderland. And it's also really hot today, so I'm excited about the AC. Uh, fresh air. Fresh air. I love the butterflies flying across the top like that. There's a hidden Mickey right there on the head. I love this part. We told Ludovic that we come down here and we do a loop. <laughs> He's like, what? Loop? When I was little, at the end of the ride, was you hear that game? I always thought it was going to be so loud I'd cover my ears. It's not that loud. Ludovic, what did you think of Alice in Wonderland? Really good. Dude. You really liked it? Good dark ride. It's yeah. Good dark ride. It's a good dark ride. It's it's on the second level. Yeah, I see. Yeah. Mr. Toad's is below it. But more for still. Yeah. Well, yes. Mr. Toad's is, is crazy. But uh, did you like the, uh, the all the like the animations? Yeah, very really good. I think it's a uh, refurbishment, not something like that. Yeah, it's uh, it's been green, it's, uh, yeah, have, it's been refurbished a couple years ago. So very really good. It's fresh. Here's a big difference between Disneyland and Disneyland Paris. Pinocchio, it's the exact same attraction in Disneyland Paris, but in Disneyland Paris? Much bigger, much, much more audience. Yeah, uh, is it much more audience? It's very popular, very popular. It never has less than 45 minute wait. They love it in Disneyland Paris. And he was like, here, he's like, there's no line. I'm like, eh, it's not as popular in America. No line. Why do people like it so much? The voice, our French version. Your French voice version? It's very good. And 
We love uh, when it's scary, when it's uh, small. You like, you like the scary? You like sad, you like sad. Uh, you like the sad? Sad, uh, sad thing, uh, okay. we love that. France, they like scary and sad. <laughs> like movie French, French, yeah. French movies like that. All right, so for the number four thing that Ludovic wants to recommends that you cannot get Disneyland Paris, we have to go into New Orleans Square. Let's check this out. All right, so this is where we have to come. It's the Royal Street Veranda. Let's show you what we're gonna get. This is called the Steak Gumbo. So big. It, it's so it's, it's so big. So big. Yeah. yeah and, and so I, I'm surprised for one thing. No people in line. We ask, and uh, one minute after. The food came fast. Uh, very, uh, very, very good fast. service. Yeah, yeah, yeah good very, service. Very good service. In California, very good service. All right. So, let's see if you like it. Good. Is it spicy? A little spicy. Yeah. Now, Ludovic, they take the bread, and they get. They get, sometimes they'll dip it. It's not baguette. That's not a baguette. <laughs> <laughs> you yeah, dip it, uh huh, and then you can do that, and then eat, you scrape out the bread from the bowl. It's a bread bowl. With the beef, mm, so good. Yes. Very good. I like Very it good. a lot. Ludovic keeps saying, it's, he's like, it's so much, your portions are so big. It's so big. Yeah. Too much, too much. <laughs> it's for three persons. That. No, it's not for three people. It's two people. One person. Ludovic's like, I wish my stomach was bigger. I told him that you don't have to eat the bread. That's optional. You don't have to eat it. But I uh, said that you know what they have in Disney California Adventure, Ludovic? No. They have the, a bread bowl with macaroni and cheese. Cheese and pasta. Oh, I prefer this one. Oh, and the mac and cheese is really good too. But they don't have this in Disneyland Paris, guys. This is the fourth thing you can't get in Disneyland Paris. Is it good? Wow, oh, good. <laughs> American? Frenchman. So Ludovic is very interested in doing Mr. Toad's because they do not have it in Disneyland Paris either. In fact, Mr. Toad's, the only place that you can ride this attraction, right here in Disneyland. Now the sign has Latin on it. I've talked about this before. It says, Toad I Accelerate Semper uh, Absurdia, which means the forever speeding toad is, is, is crazy, it's Latin. But in Disneyland Paris, they do have a toad hall. It's a restaurant though, it's only a restaurant. Go in and eat. And on the side, it says, no eating frog legs. No. He's like, does everybody come up and kiss it? I'm like, no. Are we coming princess, no? No. Nobody does that. He only had one hand on the steering wheel. Yeah, I said, French. Ludovic, you need two hands. And he's like, in America, two hands? I'm like, yes. He's like, in France, it's one yeah, hand yeah. and the other hand. <laughs> okay, for the number three treat, we're gonna be in New Orleans Square and I'm taking Ludovic to get a mint julep. Now this one I'm a little nervous about because I don't know um, 
It's a very acquired taste. We'll see if he likes it. I love New Orleans Square. I love walking through these streets and going to, it just feels so good. You like it too? Yeah. Yes, it's so good, so good. All right, so there's our mint juleps. Beignets. Yeah. Beignets. Here, a little bit, can you carry the mint juleps? This is our beignet sauce. All right, we're just about ready to enjoy our mint juleps. We got beautiful music on over here. Let's do this. Okay, so, Ludovic, there are rules. Okay. First, you have to drink the pinky out. Is this? It's classy. Okay. Like a British. Oh, uh, yeah. Number two, some. I love this. Lots of people don't. Okay. Some people think it tastes like toothpaste. Great. Okay, let's do it. Cheers. Cheers. Delicious. Oh, it's okay. It's, it's okay? Yes. A lot of mint. Lots of yes, it's mint. Yeah, lemon. Mint. Little sugar. It's a little acid. A little, a little acid? Yeah. Okay. From now on, this drink shall be known as the little acid. It's so good. Little acid for the win. Also, I have a beignet for you to try. Oh, great. Okay, this is a pumpkin beignet. Ludovic's like, no pumpkin. I'm like, you have to try a pumpkin beignet. Okay. So, there you go. They're Ooh. not normally pumpkin. They're oh, usually yeah. regular. Pumpkin is just for this oh, season. Oh, very, very hot. Very hot? Um, they smell so good. Good. Uh, beignet and little acid together, so good. Oh yeah, for the win. Look, oh! A lot of sugar, mm -hmm. big uh, cinnamon, cinnamon flavor. Okay, during fall, Halloween, everything has cinnamon and nutmeg. Nutmeg's a flavor. And they call it pumpkin spice. Not spice? Not spicy? Uh, uh, no, it's not spicy, it's just they call it pumpkin spice. It's, it's a name. Okay, yeah. that's good, very really good. You really, oh you like? I think it's pumpkin inside, but no, 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 you thought there's a pumpkin inside? Yes. Oh, that'd be gross. <laughs> In France, we have a crepes with pumpkin. <gasps> yeah. You have crepes with pumpkin? Yep. It's the name in French, crepette. Crepette au potion. Order that. Of course, Amanda, she got the caramel for her, for her uh, pumpkin. Pumpkin caramel, but I don't know. Right now, I want to go to France because I want to crepe with pumpkin. Oh my gosh. Because we were talking about how a lot of the things here are flavored pumpkin, but in France, you could get, it's like actual pumpkin in the crepes. Mm. How is it? Mm -hmm. Really good. You're, you're happy? Well guys, we're now gonna take uh, Cameron, Greg, and Ludovic on Splash Mountain because they do not have this at Disneyland Paris. And so Ludovic really wants to ride that. Then we're gonna continue on with some more food. Ludovic just told me that the best attraction at all is Indiana Jones. Adventure. Indiana Jones, uh, adventure, excuse me. Then, Splash Mountain, then rides. That's the order. Yeah, people are going to freak out. It's a good ride. Uh, it's a very good ride, but I think people think rides is the best. Indiana? It's a good ride. The rides is a good ride, but I prefer Indiana Jones for the theme. The theme for Indiana Jones. The one line? The line, the queue. The queue. The queue. Yeah, very good. And this one's for the characters. Oh, you like this one for the characters? Characters, music. Music, very good. Oh, okay. And the splash at the end. Oh, the splash at the end, of course. Oh. Ludovic will read those comments. Put down what you think the three best attractions are and see if it matches up with Ludovic's. Ludovic and uh, Cameron Greg had a plan to pour water on me. So I switched it up last second and made him right in the front. <laughs> Sucker! Good luck, Ludovic. Oh, thank you so much. I found this out that Ludovic loves all the water rides. Because in Disneyland Paris, they don't have any water rides. So this is a big novelty, riding all these rides. Stroke, stroke, stroke. We're in so much trouble, the little hill. We are way drenched. Ludovic's, no. I've never been this wet in a ride in my life, ever. Oh, they, everything's wet. Ludovic lost his cap. We, this was, I mean, this is insane. I, this is the wettest, wet. yeah, it's insane. It's literally, that was the wettest I've ever been on the last mountain. There's nothing dry. Look at Ludovic's pants. 
We lost his hat. We're super sad about that. We're hopefully we'll get it back later on. Ludovic's a little sad because he lost his cap, his hat. And so we're gonna see if we can find another one that he likes. And then we'll continue on. Okay, for the number two food that you can only get here in Disneyland and not Disneyland Paris, we're gonna take Ludovic to Dole Whip. Dole Whip. First Dole Whip for Ludovic. First, you can try it, see if he likes it. Here we go. All right, Ludovic, here we go. Wow, so huge. So huge. A tower, <laughs> tower Dole Whip. Ludovic thinks that we eat a large portions. Big. Big, yes. But so good, Ludovic. Uh, yeah. You're going to like this. We have a table right over here, we're gonna sit down. It's so ice cream, yes. No, no it's, not it's, it's Dole Whip. But not it's, ice cream. It's no, it's special. Okay. It's magical. Wow. Fairy dust. Okay, Ludovic, your very first Dole Whip. Here we go. I couldn't take that. Like this? It's pineapple. Mm. Is it good? Mm. This looks like a vacation now. It's a oh. vacation? It's vacation. Here's my sweet wife, Amanda. Oh, hey, babe. It's tropical. It's tropical. I love that. Now yeah. this tastes like vacation. So it tastes like vacation? Mm -hmm. Is it a good view? I gave, yes, it's a good view. I gave Little Vic the option of a Dole Whip with pineapple juice. I want the original. But he he's like, no, 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 I, I want the original. So I think that was a smart choice. I what do you think? It's a very smart choice. It's a very smart it's choice. It's fun here because they have a bunch of different flavors. You, you can get, get raspberry, pineapple, mango. But the pineapple? Pineapple is the original. This is the original. And um, when is this created? This, uh, this when is it created? Uh, yes. Oh, a long time ago. You can you can eat that in the, far, in the galaxy for far away. Yeah, yeah. galaxy far away. <laughs> you can eat it in the tiki room. So you can take it in the tiki room. Yes, yeah, the dream of Walt Disney to have a restaurant and you have a bird. And, uh, yes, it was a dream of Walt Disney to have a restaurant and had the birds. Exactly. So it's, it's kind of kind of. Mm -hmm. Why are you looking really good? Thank you. So, I, well, I feel good now that I'm eating the Dole Whip. Tastes like vacation. I love that. That like nailed it perfectly. Yes, know that perfectly. Okay. Very good. So Ludovic just told me that the brand Dole, you know, as in like Dole Whip, Dole Pineapple, D-O-L-E, that is, he is not familiar with that brand in France. He doesn't think Dole is in France. Hence, no Dole Whip. And of course, the Dole Whip is sponsored by Dole. And I'm finished. Finished. Good. Very good. This is one of the cutest things I've ever think I've ever, it just, it touches my heart. In Disneyland Paris, maps are kind of a big deal. So Ludovic brought a whole bunch of maps of Disneyland Paris that show Disneyland Paris and Walt Disney Studios over there. And then what he's doing is he's, when he meets a cast member that provides what he calls a magical experience, he then gives them a map to say thank you. We give a lot of maps. We've been giving out a lot of maps. And so we're always on the hunt for somebody to give, so we give a map to all the cast members. I think that's very kind of you, Ludovic, to do that. Now we're gonna do the honorable mention before we get to number one. Let's do the honorable mention. You ready, Ludovic? Yes, ready. Honorable mention. All right, the honorable mention is the churro. What? And a lot of you thought the churro should be number one. I thought it for a minute it should be number one, but Ludovic, the number one, he chose it himself. So this is the honorable mention. In Disneyland Paris, they don't have churro carts. They have crepe carts. You only get crepes right there, so there's no churros. But but we have a churros in a Fuente de Ro restaurant there. In Fuente de Land restaurant, they have a Mexican restaurant there, and they're churros, and they're this big. Like, it's a you, it's not breadstick, yeah. it's a you. And it's served with ice cream, so it's not even close to being the same. So this is his first chance to have a churro. Woo! Put it down in the comments down below. Would you rather have a churro cart or a crepe cart? All right, so here he is. He's trying, he's just gonna try a churro. Here we go, this is, this is, this is an original. The normal. It's warm. Natural. That's Nat warm. All natural. All right, let's see. A lot of sugar. Oh, it's got sugar and cinnamon. It's warm inside. Nice to go. Yeah, much sugar. What do you think? Very good. Very good. More better than Paris, more tasty. Oh, it's better. Oh, yes, definitely definitely better than that little tiny one they have in Disneyland Paris. But what do you think? This is better than the crepes? No. What if you had a crepe with a churro inside it and Nutella? Really good. Good choice. Maybe it's a bewitch. Really. Yeah, absolutely. So here it is, your honorable mention, guys. You can't get this in Disneyland Paris. Get the churro. The number one food that you can get in Disneyland, but you can't get in Disneyland Paris, 
And this is this is Ludovic's choice. He chose this. Corn dog. Corn dog. He says this is the best thing we have here at Disneyland. Yeah, we eat that, uh, yes, okay. we, we had it the other day and he loved it. You watched that video over here where we had it for the first time. So when I showed him the list of food, he's like, no, 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 no. Corn dog, number one. So let's get a corn dog, guys. Number one. According to Ludovic, this is the greatest thing if you're a Disneyland Paris cast member and you ever come here, or you're from Disneyland Paris and you come here, you want to try something very American, get the corn dog right here. So this is the number one thing that we have here offer here at Disneyland. Number one? I think it's number one. Yeah, it's number one. Also, just so you guys know, if you want to come here to Disneyland, the best way to do it is you can click the link down below uh, and it'll give you the very best prices on Disneyland tickets. Disneyland hotels or whatever you want to do through Getaway Today or you can call 1-855-GETAWAY. Also, if you're thinking of going to Disneyland Paris, you want to go to Disneyland Paris, it's amazing. How awesome is Disneyland Paris? So good. How do you say... Like this. How, how, do you say, how do you say... How do you say... Oh, très bien. Tellement, Dis tellement bon, très bien. Disneyland Paris, tellement, tellement bon, bien. Good? Yeah. <laughs> if you want to go to Disneyland Paris, then you have to call the number 1-855-GETAWAY. Don't click the link. You have to call them and tell them you want to go to Disneyland Paris and tell them Provost Park Pass sent you and they'll get you the best prices on their hotels there and on the tickets. They'll plan your whole, the whole, your whole Disneyland Paris vacation. It's awesome. How is it? So good. So we'll good. Be What's that? We'll be on. Okay. And just so you guys want to do, we want to do a little uh, French lessons right now. How do you say so good? Tellement bon. Yeah, tellement bon. How do you bon. say? How do you say awesome? Incroyable. Incroyable. How do you say suck the blue? Suck the blue. Hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, and I hope you guys enjoy this video. You guys say goodbye to Ludovic because he's going back to Disneyland Paris today. We're yeah. gonna miss you. A lot. We're gonna miss you a lot. Yeah. Guys, he's the very best, and uh, he I is. I miss that. Yes, you'll miss this. Thanks, guys, for watching. Talk to you later. <laughs> bye bye. Bye.